Hey, this is Jason. Hey, it's Jada. And welcome, welcome to, to the Pettit Life. Life. Hey guys, it's Jada. It's Jason. Welcome to the Pettit Life. It's story time. So story time is basically something we're going to do from time to time to either go over future plans that are coming up or, or why we do things. And this time it's going to be how we even got into this whole YouTube thing right. and why we did it. Um, and basically, whenever we go do our own adventures and stuff like that, we're like a lot of people. We get on YouTube and try and research stuff and figure out what's going on. But we figured out that a lot of times we couldn't find a lot of the information uh, that we wanted, or at least not an in-depth amount of information that we wanted. So, or we, yeah. Actual overviews of places that we wanted to go and specific things that we wanted to see about locations. Right. It was more in-depth. and. Yes. So I would kid around and joke around from time to time. I was like, you know what, we just need to start our own channel and do our own stuff and then maybe it'll help somebody out. And finally, right. uh, this January, we, we actually did that. And, uh, we did. And it's done a lot better than I thought it would do uh, so far and, uh, and stuff like that. But that, that's what got the whole thing started is that uh, I, we just started to kind of do our own reviews on So the first place we went after we did that was down to Gulf Shores in Alabama. If you haven't checked those videos out, please do so. And we were trying um, to find... And that was our first kind of... When we started doing those reviews of the hotel we stayed at and the surrounding areas and some of the activities and things we did, we tried to do them the way that we would have liked to seen them done if we were watching a review on, on like... Uh, the nature center or the state park campground or the hotel that we stayed at um, and that's the, the reason. restaurants we went to and stuff like that we did them we tried to do them like we were going to be watching them ourselves and the things that we would want to see had had we looked up that location right and so hopefully we did a pretty good job of of uh putting that information out there that way. That's what we've tried to do. And according to your guys' comments, it has helped several of you. Yeah. Especially being down in Gulf Shores and yeah. Orange Beach and that whole Pensacola, Orange Beach area. And for everybody that commented and asked questions and we really appreciated the comments and everything, but I think it really legitimately helped a lot. Yeah, we had several a people. Lot of we people. even had someone on the staff at the hotel we stayed at. Uh, yes. messages and say hey you know uh, we were I, I work in the kitchen in the kitchen here and really uh -huh. enjoyed your all's video about our about uh, our, our hotel, about our hotel. And so the that was food cool. and yeah. yes so that was nice and I give honest and fair assessments of everything now I'll try to be polite about it uh, just like we had a situation uh, at Margaritaville down there in Pigeon Forge that wasn't the best at the restaurant uh, Which I'm sure now is yeah, hopefully is probably maybe somebody watched that bloomed and, and booming and everything's fine. But it wasn't like I said the, the food was actually good. It's just the, the service, the service could have been a, a little better. But you know, yeah. hopefully, uh, maybe if they if the hotel didn't see it, maybe some of you guys when you went there mentioned something about it. And hopefully they've got that cleaned up now. And that that place is just incredible. Uh, right. all the way around. I know it had the potential to be. We're going to maybe go back uh, there. Yeah, we'll go camp. back there and do a, maybe actually maybe camp there. Maybe in the there. fall or something. And then we'll, yeah. so we'll go back to the restaurant, give it another shot, and and if it's better, then I'll get on here and I'll say it's better, you know? Right. Uh, but the reviews, like we did a review on our camp, our initial camp setup this year. I went through, and we went, I went through the outside and she went through the inside of the camper and tried to interject the things that we liked and didn't like about that one. Uh, this new camper that we got went around the outside and I had the salesman, uh, Jerry Lowe, that, that I got the camper from. We went through it and let him do the walk through and to let see you guys kind of see what that experience was like. To see um, if anybody potentially wanted those yeah, types of campers so they looking, would have an idea of what it looked like inside and outside, the functionality of yeah. everything. And the things that we liked and didn't like and kind of wished were a little different. And right. And this racing thing has really blown up. And that surprised me. <clears throat> I grew up around racing. I'm a third generation driver. Um, I would probably still be racing had I not went off to the service when I did, which I'm glad I did that. Right. Um, 
but I still love it and always will. And so maybe my passion for it shows through with the videos. I've had several people get on here and comment about the style that we're doing the videos in. Um, people really seem to enjoy it, and that's that's incredible. That's awesome. Uh, we're going to try to keep so that going. Gonna so there's going to be a lot more racing videos because we see what most of our subscribers have been so far. And, and we're gonna, all and it's all fans. racing, almost, <laughs> almost all dirt track racing. Now yeah. we're gonna keep doing all the rest of the stuff that yeah, we do. Yeah, because we like doing it. In those and playlists, we want, yeah, so they'll be. Yeah, we want people to see. If you all don't haven't seen in, uh, on the channel, I have put things in playlists. That way, you can go watch whatever you want to watch. You can watch our vacations, our reviews, our trips, or the racing videos. Uh, so we'll continue to do that and mm -hmm. continue to do stuff like this, explaining why. And, uh, and things like that. But Just yeah, story uh, time videos. Yeah. Basically about what our life, what we do. Let you all get to know us a little day. better and, and, and kind of be a little more personable with it because a lot of times I'm behind the camera instead of in front of it. And uh, so we want to let you guys kind of in a little bit more into who we are and how we turned out the way we did and why, you know, why we do these, why we decided to do this. We've stuff. got some good racing videos coming up. Yeah. Yeah, we got another um, uh, big one coming up this weekend. It's going to be we've already Iron gotten, Man race. We've already gotten tickets for several races throughout the yeah, summer. Um, me and Dad are planning to go to the Eldora Million, so you'll have that one coming up um, uh -huh. on Thursday night, the Thursday night race. We're not going to we're not going to do the dream uh, because I have to work. Well, that's an some, entire week. Yeah, that's an entire week. Yeah, and but I, the I can't million's do that. on but Thursday. But the million, that's the first time that they're going to do that in a long time. And that's so, on Thursday. And then... So we're planning to go to it. And, uh, we uh, have a race coming up And then there's two races. Sunday. There's Yeah, there's two and races coming up. Yeah, there's two races coming up. Uh, this Sunday, Memorial Day, uh, yeah. at Lake Cumberland Speedway again. And then the following Friday, uh, we'll be at Ponderosa Speedway, which is the track that, unfortunately, the Lucas Oil race got canceled at. Uh, a few weeks back. Uh, hopefully the weather will cooperate this time and it'll be another uh, Ironman, uh, a Babylon Ironman series race. Uh, it'll be so a good it'll, race. It'll, that should be two two pretty good races good coming up. Good purses. Um, yeah, one of them's 5,000 and change, the other one's I think 7,500 again. Yeah. Um, so. And then the million. Like, yeah, and then the million coming up. We also have tickets already for, was it Bill? Oh, uh, we are going to go to the North South 100. That's also, it. We're Friday going and Friday night. and Saturday night yep. for that so one. So I'll film it. So we've and, got some good races uh, coming up. I'm going to try to get to the World 100 again this year if we can. Yeah. If we can. And then whatever else we can squeeze in in between with work and everything else, camping trips and stuff. But we got some good videos coming up. Some good content, hopefully. Yeah. To yep. To, uh, hopefully we'll be camping down at Kendall Recreation Area below uh, Wolf Creek Dam in Jamestown. The, we already have done some videos. Lake. Yeah, there's We some, took one of the vets down yeah, there. Yeah, we've been down there before with the Corvette. But, uh, yeah. I might do a little bit of filming there. We're going to try, and we haven't, this just hasn't worked out yet with the electric box uh, doing any filming with those. But, so that should be interesting so, filming because I haven't been on a bicycle in yeah. <laughs> 25 years yeah, probably. Yeah, that some interesting footage. <laughs> <laughs> Getting her, we won't uh, cut any of that out. Yeah, it'll be raw well, <laughs> with that one. So probably, that should be real fun. I'll probably put a put a helmet cam on and <laughs> get behind her and give you all a show. Probably and watch me watch fall her off the cliff side so, somewhere. That'll be interesting. It'll be fun. But, but we just wanted to. We just want to get on here and and kind of talk to you guys a little bit about. Uh, Kind of why we started, why doing, we started all. doing all this, and it was just for fun. Uh, I never thought that, and, and we may never end up monetized, you know. But uh, if we do, we want you all to know who the real Jason and Jada are, and and let you in a little bit. And you know, we'll do a, we'll keep doing videos with our critters here and there whenever uh, as they grow up and and, and develop and, and bigger. We brought Juju. Uh, with us camping this weekend and she stayed an entire night in the new camper mm -hmm. uh, can't Last believe I let night. that happen but it did and there were no accidents uh, she 
No, she was good she all was day. She was good. She, we put a pad in here, and she, you know, went number one on her pad, and there were no number two accidents, oh, you know, during the night. No, she was exhausted. Yep. She literally slept all she night long in the bed. She crawled right up there and slept in the bed and did not make a move. No. All night, so she's our camp dog, if you will, or she's going to be whenever right. she gets to where she can stay with us the whole weekend. Here's some pictures of Juju this weekend on her little camping trip. Like I said, she did pretty good. She loves laying in the cool grass by the campsite and chilling inside on the recliners and hanging out with Daddy and stuff like that. She did pretty good. Kai being a Rottweiler, listen, she, I don't think she hurt anybody if we were with her, but people people just freak out about breeds like that around She's a, like big dog she's a big too. powerful dog and if she, she did doesn't decide look big on camera or on a picture yeah, but she's about 130 she's pounds, about 130 pounds and, and she's a, a beastie of a girl yeah <laughs> but so we can't bring her places like this no or uh, we choose not to because to, to avoid we're actually uh, camping uh, yeah still. and you kind of if you can kind of see it yeah we're at burnside island we're at burnside island which is uh, a state park here in our home state of kentucky yeah it's getting ready to rain yeah it's getting ready to rain here a little bit but uh but we just want to know we're just let you guys know that we really appreciate you all and if anybody has any ideas or things that they want us to or any races that you want or us any to try races to go around to this area or this region wherever that, that you'd like to see, I'll try to see if I can get to it and uh, For sure. and get some footage of it. Yeah, uh, I'm always, I've been to about every racetrack in the surrounding state area, and uh, I, there's, I'm sure there's one somewhere that I haven't been to that I'd like to go. So tell us where uh, you want so us to yeah, go to. If you want us to go, we'll somewhere, go somewhere and check one out, then I'll try my best even, to get to it. Even yeah. campgrounds around yeah, campgrounds, the state of Kentucky, if there's yeah. something that somebody Tennessee, wants to Ohio, say. Ohio, Tell uh, us, West we'll Virginia, go. Virginia, Indiana. We'll go find it, and with, we'll get there. With diesel as high as it is right now, we've chosen to kind of stick a little bit closer to home camping this year, so that right. we can try to get to a few more races. Yeah. Uh, but. But just whatever, what oh, whatever but, yeah. you all recommend, we'll go see what we can do. Yeah, we're open to suggestions and. Uh, but we appreciate you. So yeah, please uh, continue to like and share and comment and subscribe, subscribe and hit share that it on your bell. facebook or tell your friends your about instagram us. or whatever it is yep. that you use the more we grow the more we're gonna keep growing for you all um, and be able to take you along take wherever you, you want us to go yeah if we ever do end up monetized then i will take that money and put it towards the channel and and go, we'll go to uh, venture out to more rate right, you know what i mean like Maybe maybe next year or something we can go down and do a little bit of this the Florida Speed Week stuff or something like that. And tell them a little bit of you know, That's what we want to do. You know, we, we're gonna since we have this this there's a big master plan here with all this, and at some point uh, we'd like to be able to travel around with this camper, and, and do and film a lot of the races and, right. and camp along the way. You know, kind of roll it all into one big package. That's what our you know that's that end would be our end goal be. is to travel around. Uh, yeah. And camp in cool places and go to races that are there and right. and then put them on put them on camera because we know that not everybody can get to places like that. Should not we can't always do, get to places like that. And, right. and now that we're fortunate enough to be able to do a little bit of that, we want to share it with everybody. Of course. And we want to continue to do that. So if we ever do end up monetized, that will I just want everybody to know that will go right back into the channel and we'll use that money. For uh, to get a little better equipment and a little better and then be able to afford to maybe fly even and go places and and if nothing else afford, afford diesel fuel to be able to drag this camper to the Dakotas or to the wherever. west coast or northeast or southeast wherever there's good dirt track racing going on at the time you right. know we'll hop around and go I'll consider it'll be like a old outlaw late model thing where wherever the money's at, that's where I'll be too, just with a camera instead of a car this time, trying to get the footage for you all. So that's kind of the plan when we, if and when we get to it. Uh, but all right, well. But anyway. That's pretty much on yeah. story time. Story time number one. Yeah, and we'll do another one in a couple of weeks. Yeah. Maybe just give you a little background information on more of us. Us. Kind of what you know. Yeah.
Yep. But we appreciate you guys. Like, share, subscribe, everything. Share it to all your social medias. Yep. Yeah, so. we're on uh, Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, and obviously YouTube. Right. And it's all the pet it life. It's all the pet it life. So. Always. Thank you, guys. <laughs> Until next time. Bye, guys. Bye. As always, thanks for watching, guys, and stay tuned for our next big adventure. Like, share, and subscribe to get that content.